Wonders, the Fox 55 Severe Weather Team answers your weather-related questions that interest you. Tonight, meteorologist Devante Dixon explains the difference between wet snow and dry snow. Whether snow is wet or dry lies within the amount of water stored in the snow. We refer to this as the snow to liquid ratio. The average snow ratio is 10 to 1, which means that 10 inches of snow is equivalent to 1 inch of water. The snow is easy to shovel, and you can even have fun sledding in it. When the snow is wet, it is heavy, slushy, and a pain to shovel. However, it is perfect for making snowmen and snowballs because of its slushy-like texture. This type of snow usually has an 8 to 1 or 5 to 1 ratio, which forms when temperatures are running near the freezing mark or slightly above it. The lower the ratio, the heavier the snow. Dry snow is very fluffy, and it looks like fat flakes falling from the sky. This type of snow typically has a 15 to 1 or 20 to 1 ratio. The greater the number, the drier the snow will be. It typically occurs when temperatures are in the teens near the surface and the upper levels of the atmosphere are extremely cold. This type of snow is powdery and it blows around easily. Regardless of the type of snow, it can be a headache when driving. The next time you hear wet, dry, or normal snow, you'll know the difference. I'm meteorologist Devante Dixon for Weather Wonders. And if you have any weather question you want to have answered, you can go to WFFT.com slash weatherwonders or email us at weatherwonders at WFFT.com.